Welcome back to my channel everyone. This is Donnie and you're watching Diamond Painting by Donnie. I have a whole week of Diamond Art Club unboxings for you. So today kicks off the week of Diamond Art Club and the only reason I'm doing this is because I have a bunch of of packages that I've received over the last couple of months that I've never opened just because I've been too busy and I've just been taking too many days off so I haven't been able to get around to doing them so yes today is my birthday November 1st and I said I wasn't gonna work today but I forgot that I had my new releases from this week coming today so this is the only thing I'm going to do today and then I'm gonna take the rest of the day off. <laughs> so let's get started opening this box. Um, I believe there are four diamond paintings in here. I'm not gonna put the box up here because it's pretty big, but you know what their boxes look like. Um, I ordered these on Saturday, last Saturday, um, for the Diamond and Ruby pre-release. Uh, yeah, for the pre-release last Saturday, and they arrived today. Friday, November 1st, so it took six days, and the only reason why it's taking six days to get to me is because they moved their warehouse over to New Jersey, and I'm in Oregon, and before they moved it, they had their warehouse in Nevada, and so I was getting them in about three days. Yeah, I could pay extra, like $17 to make sure they got here in two days, but... I figured they'll get here when they get here. I don't have new, uh, I don't have sneak peeks, and I probably won't be getting any more sneak peeks. But I do have new releases to show you. So give me a second to open this, and I will be right back. Okay, so here um, is my newest book for keeping all my inventory in, and I just wanted to show real quick what it looks like when it's been sealed with Ma, uh, Tombow Mono Aqua liquid glue. Um, you can see the sparkle is still there, very much so. And it also, because I have these lights going on it, you can see the shine of where I actually coated the actual surface of the notebook with the glue as well. And I think it makes it look so much prettier having that layer of glue on there because this is what it looks like before the glue. And look at how shiny that is. You can see I didn't do it on the bind, the binding, but then you get over to the front, you can see how shiny it is. So I am super happy with using the mono, the, yeah, that stuff. I'll link it down below but it does make the cover very stiff, so I will not be forcing it to bend like the back can bend. This is how it used to bend, and now it's completely stiff. So as long as I keep it stiff, I don't think I'll have a problem with it cracking. So anyway, I am going to pull up the first one. It's the smaller one, so this one is called the Pink Mermaid, and well, Pink Mermaid, and here is a photo of it. And the artist on this is called Chibimika Art, and it's $34.99 on their website. It's 40, a 42 by 51, has 35 colors with three ABs, and it is square. So, put that to the side, and... Let's get this open. So I picked the smallest box of the four. And of course, I was nice and surprised to see that it has the snowflake holographic on it, as you can see there. I'm hoping maybe for my birthday today, somebody will actually um, put up my lighting for me. It would be really nice to stop getting the circles and the big old uh, lamp glare on my packages and diamond paintings. I bought the lighting and now I need the legwork to get it done. 
I'm going to try to get through these as quick as possible, but I also want to give you as much detail about them as possible because I know you like that and that helps you determine if you want to buy this specific diamond paintings. So here is our sticker page with the color list to copy and keep with the diamond painting or the box or my inventory or whatever it is and then I use these stickers on the canvases or I mean on the containers for organizing when I do a diamond painting and here we go it is now the empty box look at the drills in a moment same toolkit that they put in their diamond paintings I'm gonna go through this one and because this one is square, they included a pair of the pointy tweezers. And that these are awesome for squares. They give you a blue sticking drill pen, a squishy, several baggies, a three placer, and two heart waxes, and a clear tray. the ones that are round will not come with tweezers because they don't work so well. Those pointy tweezers don't work so well with the uh, rounds. All right. So let's look at this canvas. And it has, I don't know if I said that it has three ABs in it number one, two, and the dot. So the dot is going to be the white, 141. Number one is 126, and two is 127, so pink and purple, which there's a lot of that in this. Pink mermaid. All right. Here's the bottom. So I'm going to roll it so that we can see the top first. And I'm going to roll it outward because I'm going to just help get it flat faster. I like starting at the top, that's all. And there are our instructions. Curled up inside of there. And... we go. So look at that delicious pink color. Oh my word. That is just stunning. I mean, pictures don't do it justice to be able to see somebody posting pictures on Instagram or on, on, um, Amazon, not Amazon, gosh, Facebook. You really can't appreciate how beautiful something is until you see it in person. But I mean, we can get as close to that as we can here on a video, but um, I'll show you this drill field. If you've never seen the Diamond Art Club canvas before, I've never had issues with being able to tell what the symbols are or the clarity of them. So lots of pink, um, 35 colors. So, you know, because you have this uh, foliage down here, and yes, I'm pretty sure this is foliage because I'm pretty sure this is her tail over here, the pink and the purple. Well, may, that pink might be foliage too. I don't know. I'm really bad at determining what's foliage and what's... Um, actually, it's not foliage. It's her hair. So um, this is her tail. Um, I think, I don't know, because this is her tail too, the green, because it shows down here, the body part. <laughs> I am horrible, really horrible. I think it's all her tail. And then we got some of the water, just a little bit of water down here, but then there's more water over on this side right here. And... There's another piece of her tail off over here. Okay, so AB colors. We have 
one, two, and the dot. So you're not going to get any of it up in the sky. Now the dot, the white AB is going to be her jewelry, it looks like, which I think is very interesting to have these cute pieces of jewelry in her hair. Uh, you've got this thing right there that is supposed to be, I think, an earring, yes, because this is like a, a, like a fishy webbed ear. And so this is the earring that goes on it. And then here's another earring here. And then you've got her hair clip, her nose ring, and her freckles. Those are all going to be white AB. And you've also got, I'm having to reference back to the picture here. She's got a chain of like pearls in her hair that goes down here. And that's also the AB color. And it looks like they just put a strand of her hair right here as AB and the outline of her tail and the outline of it here. So there's a lot of the white AB throughout. Now one and two are going to be, see two is a really light color as well. It's almost white. It's, but it's a light pink and it, it kind of highlights, um, here in the clip in her hair. Oops, I'm not even in the camera. And here in the clip and her ear. I haven't seen one yet, but I'm keeping my eyes peeled. So I've seen two in the dots so far. Her tongue, I think that is so cute. I think it's supposed to be sexy, but I think it's cute. And um, yeah, here in the tail, you have more of number two. Number one, okay, is going to be in her hair down here, which, um, is that her hair? Yeah. Yeah. In her hair. And it is a light purple. So it goes, I think that might be her body. No, it's her hair. Gosh, I'm really bad, getting bad at this. More twos here. And the tail over here has a lot of ones and a little bit of twos. So you're going to have ABs um, for the tail, her hair, um, outlines, and jewelry, and freckles, and the tail. Yeah, I did say the tail, but a different part of the tail right here. And it looks like it might be a little bit in her body too. Anyway, it's in places. It's not all over the place. It's just in certain places throughout. So, um, let me fold this up and we will look at the drills. Wow. That was the longest minute in my life. I had someone make a call me and I had my daughter come in and she brought me a birthday cake, which you can see right here. That was happy. And she always likes to chit chat with me when she gets home from work. So starting off a very good birthday. Anyway, let's look at these drills. Now these colors are definitely matched to the diamond painting. Um, I forgot to double check the canvas number, but it does say it on here. So, uh, let's see, 765S, 765S AB. Yep. That is, oops, put the wrong one over. All right. So let's look at some of these beautiful colors. Uh, not going to go really in detail because... Yeah, I've got a lot more to go. So we have this beautiful pink and Teslin's home. So get ready for her to come barging in. Okay, beautiful pink. More pinks. And more pink. And we've got our mint color and a purple which here we go. This looks like we've got the ABs right here. 
Here is our pink. <laughs> oh, this is number two. I'm in here. Um, and there's number one right there, that purple right there. And then white is the other one. So it's right here. But there's a lot of beautiful pastels in this diamond painting. So. Trust me, they're beautiful. Hello, my darling. Hi, I got a wizard hat. You, did you win the wizard hat? Yeah. You got your name in that drawing and you won the wizard hat. That's so awesome. That is so cool. <laughs> She's going to put the wizard hat on. And... Here is a picture of what she looks like wearing her wizard hat. And review. Review. <laughs> She's um. And went to the post office. Oh, she had um got into a drawing for orders from that fundraiser. I already, I t already showed him a picture of you in the future. Future? Yeah. When I make, when I do my editing for my video, I'm gonna show him a picture. <laughs> anyway, so she got into a drawing because she um, registered online for the orders, and I'm the only one who placed an order. But she got into a drawing, and each one person from each class won the hat and I don't know how many kids actually were in that drawing but she won so either she's got really good luck or she was the only kid that entered <laughs> okay so again that was pink mermaid I know this video is taking a long time it's kind of more like a drill with me kind of thing but anyway I'm not informal if you know me by now I'm not a real f I mean I am informal I'm not a very formal youtuber I'm not gonna sit here and just get to the point like some people really like if you don't want to see the in-between chit chat then just fast forward anyway let's move on to our next diamond painting let me put this in there and then we will open up our next one which I haven't decided which one that's gonna be yet Okay, our next one is a big one. It also has, the, I don't know if they put it on all of them now, but it looks like every single one of them has the snowflake holographic. Uh, so maybe, maybe, maybe they all have it now. Give me a minute, guys. All right, this one is by Hannah Lynn. This one is called Sasha and Jet. I know you can't see the picture very well. Um, I'll put a big picture of it right here. This one is round with ABs. It, I do believe it has, let's see. It has two ABs. It's $49.99 on the website. It's a 55 by 77. And I did say it's round and 37 colors. So let's open it up and check it out. Yeah. Oh, wait. Hey, you didn't get to watch me open the box, so... You'll get to watch me open each one. Okay. Let's see. There is our very wide and long diamond painting. Here is our inventory sheet. Look at that. Isn't that cute? 
looks like a mermaid and a either a seahorse or a dragon not sure what he is completely because it only shows the head and it looks like it might be a dragon from what I see down here lots of blacks and blues and we have our kit. Same kit with no tweezers. All right. Look at the canvas. I'm excited that this one is a round because um, I will probably do rounds before I do squares, even though I've been working on rounds for quite a while right now, and I kind of am itching to do a square, but I don't want to do a huge square right now. Um, I'll get my fix of square by doing something smaller. Oh, again, it's at the bottom. I guess we'll show it from the bottom up. But I do want to uncurl this end. I'm just so uh, for those of you that have not seen Diamond Art Club canvases before, these are self-flattening canvases because they're made of a tarpaulin canvas material. But uh, it takes a little bit sometimes for them to flatten, so I just like to get the curl of the edge unflattened so it will sit down so you can see it. Well, look at that cute little belly <laughs> and a beautiful tail. And look at all those blues. And this is larger than life. Oh, my word. This is... Oh my word, look at that. Look how big it is. I mean, that is a huge head. I mean, she, her face takes up the whole, um, almost the whole width of it, at least half of it. And here are the instructions. But there is so much blue. That hair is just beautiful. I love, love this color all right so let's start at the top and we'll see what ABs we have okay so did I say two I think I said two nope there's okay yeah there's two and they're down here at the bottom number hazardous waste symbol the try the tri triangles and E all right, so it looks like they're blue colors. Uh, all right, I see E in her hair, a little bit right there, and more here. Uh, you see it once in a while in her hair, so she's going to have some AB highlights in her hair. Uh, there's some up here. And there. So, yeah, we've got some over here too. So it's it's throughout her hair. Um, the other symbol. I'm trying to see. They she actually has it in the blue color in her eye. Those are going to be uh, ABs as well. And there's one outside of her eye. Same on the other side. Uh, the tri triangles. I don't see it yet. But look at this. Look at how big that is. Uh, I love this little conch necklace. Conch shell. Mm, wow, I can't find this other symbol. But it's probably staring at me. Okay, it's... Oh, those are dots. Uh, 
Okay, here it is. It looks like it's in her hair as well. I can't believe I missed it. It's been up here. It was up here too. How far up did it go? Because I totally didn't see it. Yeah, it's up here too. Wow. So it's got three green <laughs> little triangles and here. I'm just looking for something blue. So it's actually, it looks like there's more of that color than there is of the other one. So it's throughout her hair as well. I can't believe I'm so blind. <laughs> yeah, it's over here and over here, here and here. It's everywhere in her hair in there. Yeah. So that's what we're going to get. We're going to get AB highlights in her hair. And look at this dragon. Isn't he cute? His eye. I thought it was he. The, the dragon, I think, is a boy. I just called the dragon a he. I think it's a she. You think it's a she? No, don't line that up right in here. Okay, so she also has a little bit of highlighting on her snout you down here. Dragon. Yes, the dragon. The dragon and the girl is girls. Okay, they're both girls. So yeah, the dragon has a little bit. Not the eye. I was seeing that. I said, please don't wind that up in here. <laughs> um, but yeah. Not a lot. Not a lot on the dragon, but there is a little bit. Down. Could have swore. Maybe I'm... No, yeah, there's a couple. At least one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so there's a few down towards the bottom, but that's it. And and then she also has it in her tail. So there's quite a bit of the tri-triangle AB color. Some excess glue here. I'm right in here. So I'm guessing it'll probably be in this part too. Yeah, her tail. The tail. Oh, that's her hair. I keep thinking that's her tail, but that's her hair. Her only part of her tail that shows is just right here. This side over here. And it does have this, the AB sparkles all the way up. So yeah, there we go. This is Sasha and Jet. Love it. It's beautiful. Looks like there's going to be great color blending here in the skin areas. You can see, I mean, it, from the distance you're at, it looks perfectly blended. And from up close, we've got several colors going from the edge into the Mommy, middle. But there's a lot of color blocking on the main Mommy, stomach sorry area. Mommy, to interrupt you, but um, at school, it was popcorn. Friday. Oh, we didn't send you with money for popcorn. Oh. I have money. I just forgot to send it with you. Now she's going to go find the money. <sighs> You've got your own. Yeah, this was from the, the popcorn and they gave us money. Yeah, but that's only a nickel. And I have your 50 cents in, in um, the bedroom. You could give me two. You could yeah. give me a dollar and a... A this is a nickel. That's five cents. I'll give you 50 cents next time. But you got to tell me the day before so I know to give it to you. So. Sorry, but I need to twist Go do it in the dining room, not right here. Okay. She doesn't want to make everybody angry. Yeah, because we, she knows we get. I mean, I don't tell her, but she, I'm sure she knows we get people that dislike videos with her in them. Oh, could I have candy only one? Yeah, you can have that one um, thing that looks like, or did you stick it? You stuck it over here, didn't you? It fell down, I think. Yeah, those are really good because Ayla gave me hers. It was yummy. Very okay. good. Okay. So, let's open the drills. Actually, you know what? I'm just going to see if I can point out the... Everyone, from Hold on. ABs. This is going to be a good okay. reminder. Okay. Yeah. She found my... Um, this is my magnet from the fridge I got in LA. And it had a little springy something sticking out of it. And it broke. 
It could still be used as a magnet, but I'm going to just go ahead and turn it into a cover minder. Why not? All I have to do is just slap another magnet on there. But it's one I'm going to keep because it was a memento from one of our trips to uh, L.A. Oh, my gosh. They're falling everywhere. Okay. So, oh, this blue AB is beautiful. I'm not sure which number it is, but it's this one right here. Look at that. I hope you can see it because I really don't want to open them uh, because we need to get through to the other diamond paintings. I'm trying to see where the other AB color is. It's another blue, I think. Yay. Is that yummy? yummy? Okay. There it is. There's the other blue right there. I know it's hard to see through the plastic, but it's it's this one right here. So you kind of get a, an idea of the shade of blues that will be in AB form. So there we go. That's Sasha and Jet by Hannah Lynn. And I'll be right back. I'm going to talk to Tesla in a little bit, and I'll be right back to show you the next one. Okay. This next artist is the one that um, will be, the final two will be the same artist. And she is this brand new to Diamond Art Club. Her name is Micah Jelena. Um, I have a little story to tell about her. But first, let me show you the photo for this diamond painting. It is called Remember Me, and it is limited edition because they will not be recharting it. They did not like how the face uh, translated to diamond painting. So, I might actually just maybe do away with a couple of things on it to try and make it look a little fixed. I'll show you when we get to it. So, the ones that they have on their website for this diamond painting are the only ones they're going to sell. They are not recharting it. When these are gone, it's gone for good. And... This one is a 55 by 69. It is round with AB. Uh, let me get the other information. Uh, 55 by 69. Yeah. Uh, 38 colors. There's three ABs in it. And it's $34.99. So, Micah Jelena is the artist that I discovered when I unboxed this steampunk girl diamond painting that I had made as a custom. What I had done was taken it from one AliExpress store, took the picture to another AliExpress store, made it as a custom because it was a lot cheaper on their site. When I unboxed it, I had someone tell me who the artist was and I felt bad. So I contacted her and she actually made me a digital image of the exact one that I, I did for a diamond painting. And I bought it from her. Um, she has a store on Etsy. Same toolkit. It's around, so no, no tweezers. And I never, I, I never did the diamond painting because after I was looking at it as a diamond painting later on, I noticed that there was a watermark across it was obscured, so I didn't notice it when I had the custom made, but then I saw it. And it, it's obscured, so it's like mixed in with a bunch of colors. It would just be too hard for me to do. So now, Micah Jelena is part of the Diamond Art Club um, family, so hopefully one of these days, that diamond painting, that image will make it into the diamond paintings that she does for Diamond Art Club, and I will actually get to have that actual image as a beautiful hand-charted diamond painting. So that is my wish. Here are the drills. Here is the image. So it looks like a gypsy woman. I mean, it's pretty obvious it's a gypsy woman. In fact, well, that's what I'm calling her because that's what she looks like. Beautiful birds in the background, a little caravan thing, a uh, fortune teller, maybe fortune teller, uh, 
crystal ball. She's got a dagger between her legs, hanging, dangling from her wrists. She's got lots of jewelry. So there's a lot of detail to this. So I can see why it would have been a little hard probably to get the most important feature, which is the face, um, perfectly charted. Uh, it's also got like a deck of cards on the table and some other trinkets as well. So there, like I said, there is a lot of detail to this. And I think this is one of the largest sizes. This is the largest width that they do. Uh, so in order to make, I don't know, but they weren't happy with the outcome, even though I'm okay with it, I could probably just do something to maybe alter it as I'm placing the drills, but if not, I'll just do away with the ones that I think weren't charted, that weren't, um, what they were happy, the part they weren't happy with. So here's, we're going to go bottom up because it's already been a 36 minute video. I'm running out of time and we still have one more to go. All right. So this is really wide. And like I said, there's a lot of detail, but you can see here that the box of scrolls looks pretty good. I mean, the jewelry on her hands, there's her, the dagger, the dress is beautiful. They didn't have any issues with that. It came out really nice and you can actually still see the smoke that's coming up from the incense that's being burned on the table, crystal ball, the cards, the trinkets. Here's the birds. There's one bird and there's the other bird. So this right here is what they aren't happy with. And I can imagine it's those eyelashes because yeah, I, I think that just doing away with those drills for the eyelashes underneath will make this better. Um, I mean, keeping the eyeliner there would be good, but I would, I'm probably going to do away with, yeah that extra. Other than that, I think it looks fine. It looks good. I mean, it's still me. Yeah, it's quite different, but it's still pretty, you know? And let's look to see where the ABs are going to be. Um, number one and two. And num uh, letter E. So we've got the first two and then the very last one. Those are ABs. So one, two, and E. Okay. E is going to outline the care the her little house here. E goes around here. Right there. And so it also outlines the top over here. Um, and it does. Yeah. It outlines the other features of this for the most part. It doesn't go all the way across, but it picks back up and you can see a little bit in the middle. It's, it's, um, almost all the way completely around these windows here. You hear that noise? That's my little heater going off and on. It is really cold. Okay, this orangish color is also an AB number two inside of here. So we've got ABs inside the window and right here. So the light part that's supposed to be the light that is an AB and underneath the door, um, right here, around here. No, no. Oh, you got your pictures back? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let me finish my video, okay? And then we'll look at it together. Uh, I'm looking. I don't think it's in her hair at all. I think it's mostly, yeah, in her hat, we've got the E. Or her scarf, I should say, not her hat. It's not a hat. 
Mm, the bird has it. The number two. Just a few of them. And... So there, there, it's so much confetti in this. It's really hard to pinpoint where the ABs are. But, you know, E is also in her her garment that she's wearing. It's... But mostly it's the, the building there. Wait, her skirt. Her bracelet is mostly AB. Her skirt, this is all E, that's all AB. So there are big sections of AB colors in her, her, what, her, the skirt trim and in her shoes. Let's show you the shoes. So her high heel wedges, there's a little bit there, there's, and right there, all over. So E is, uh, there's a lot of that AB down in here. Also number two is the outside border of the skirt. That is an AB. And number one, I don't see down in this section, but two and E are very dominant in this skirt. But I did say we, I saw one, where did I say I saw it? In the cabin, yeah, because it's the yellow color, the light that goes around. And this section here, and around where the, the light is on the door, up above, and a little bit in the tablecloth, one of them in the scrolls down here. Um, I wanted to look at this other little birdie here. This one has... I don't see... Yep, yeah, there's a little bit more of number two in the bir this bird over here. And I think that's part of the bird as well. At the very tip of his wing. Or maybe that's part of the... It might be part of the building. All right, so there we have it. 38 colors, and three of them are ABs. And I will try to find those AB colors in the bag without taking it out. But I, Micah Jelena has, they linked to her page from the Diamond Art Club page when they were announcing her, um, her images, her art was going to be diamond, diamond, um, paintings. She, she, they had linked her post, which asked what Micah Jelena art would you like to see as a diamond painting? And of course I commented about the one that I bought from her and she told me she remembered me. So that was super cool. I don't know if that's, if she knew anything about diamond painting at that time. But she sure does now. So that is so totally, so totally, <laughs> that is so totally cool. Awesome. Every other word that is positive that you can think of. I've got glue on my table. Ah. Okay. Oh, there's the blue that surrounds the, uh, her little cabin is this blue right here. I know, it's super hard to see it through the package, but I want to keep this video under an hour. Um, there's a lot of 310s, and here is the red that's going to be around, or reddish-orange that goes around her, that goes around her skirt. You can see that. See those ABs in there? And the only other one is the yellow. And I see a yellow right there. And I think that's it. I think they should just display the AB drills on the outside. I know that would be kind of hard to maneuver to make sure it got on the outside every single time. That's just 
All right, so it's in there. I think it's right in the middle. But you know what yellow ABs look like. I'm going to have to assume because, yeah. There you go. So three ABs. And what did I say? This was uh, $34.99. Get it now or it's gone forever. And it's round three ABs, 38 colors. All right. So let's put this one away and get to our final our final one, which is also from Micah Jelena. And I will put up a picture of it right here. This one is called Nova. And it is beautiful. I haven't opened it yet, but oh my gosh. This image is just so stunning. Let me get the information. It is $44.99. It's a square. AB with two ABs, 29 colors, 47 by 64. And again, that's Micah Jelena. I do love how they have those snowflake holographs on here. I know they're not probably technically snowflakes, like I said before, but it's a just, they look so, like snowflakes and they look really cool. I love it. All right. I forgot that the, my phone, it cuts and makes a new clip after I think 33 minutes or something. So I wasn't paying attention and it made the clip. A minute. I try to tell my kids I'm making a video. Stop messaging me on Facebook because it makes my computer ding. Message me on my phone, which I have silenced, I think. So, anyway, here is, oh my gosh, it's, it's really dark, but it's got lots of purple, a lot of purples, 29 colors, and it looks like it's two-thirds purple, and it's got 137 and 125 as AB colors, so... Let's look to see if we can find the ABs. There's a blue right there. There's one of them. And you can see it. Having square ABs is just so cool. But they're right there. And uh, the other one is this color right there. It's kind of a cream whitish color. But look at all those purples. Mm, it's a purple lover's dream. Oh, I love it. It's square though. That's, you know, that'll be my only headache is, you know, it'll take me a long time to do because it's square. But, oh my gosh, those colors are beautiful. So I've shown you the drills. So let's look at the canvas and we'll be done. Um, Toolkit, it has the tweezers because it's square. And look at it oh it starts at the top nice and and I do appreciate that Diamond Art Club started putting these in the box so it has way less chance of getting uh, warped and curled it's so much easier to work with now without um, it being inside the canvas so thank you, Diamond Art Club, for making that change. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. See, her face isn't giant. Her face doesn't take up the whole image. So this one is basically um, concentrated on her dress itself. 
which is partly what, you know, this is here. She's got like, this is all her dress in her hands and around her arm. And all this bottom half. I believe that's about half of it from here down. Yeah. Well, maybe not as half. So she is beautiful. She is stunning. Her face is just gorgeous. And her hair, I love it. But the dress is the main feature in this painting. And it's so simple, but yet so elegant. If you know what I mean. And she's got this like luxurious necklace on. She's got an armband. She's got these braided, this braided chain of some sort in her hair. And then there's snowflakes or sparkles. It looks like they're like stars. So the AB color is number one and the pound sign. And that makes all of these what these white spots here. Those are ones. So those are all A, B. I might like here in the middle, that's three, eight, six, five. I might put like a sparkler. I haven't used sparklers yet, but, um, if you want to know what a sparkler is, go watch this video right here where I show the sparklers that I was, that was sent to me. And yeah, you'll understand why I want to put that right there. But there's, I mean, like this one has the ABs going, doing a cross right here. And then the ABs on this one are doing the plus. But there's a lot of the ABs throughout here. It The number is 125. So I'm not sure what color that is exactly, but I showed it to you. It's kind of, it's kind of white, but it's kind of, um, cream colored. It's, it's not pure white, like 141 is. So it's a different, it's a different color. And the pound sign or hashtag that, uh, the new generation calls it will be, I'm probably looking right at it and can't see it, but it's blue, remember? And there was quite a bit of them in that bag. So I'm guessing it's probably down here in the dress itself because I'm not seeing it. Okay, where, where, where can you be? Okay, I see, I see one right there. Okay, yeah, here it is. It's going through here and it goes out on this part of the dress here. Um... Through, it, yeah, it kind of highlights some of these, these strips of the dress. Um, yeah, right here. Also, there's a little bit over here. And yeah, here and there, here, there, and everywhere throughout the dress. And then, so the sparkles, you're going to see the other AB, which is also all over the dress, all these spots are a b all those um ones most of those are ones you know some of them are the three eight six five but for the most part it's these are ones so all those get to be a b's and yeah i don't see the pound sign uh the hashtag the pound sign up in the top section there might be it might be yeah okay I, I see some right here, right in there. So there probably is more going it up through this tool. It looks like it's tool part of her dress that she's got over going over her head. But just glancing, I don't see it up here at all. It could be, but I don't, I'm not seeing it. But it is... There's plenty of ones. Okay, because one also is like the outline here going down this section. Those are ones. And those are ones. And there's a little bit of ones in her lips. A tiny bit on her eyes. It's this. Let me see what it is on this picture. You don't see it real well in the picture, but it, there's 
it's actually like black in the picture, but it's done in AB, that like chain. I thought it was a braid, but it's just a chain. And her earrings here actually have some of the ABs as well. And I'm in love with all the purple. And this image is just beautiful. So, lots of black. The background has um, a lot of black in 939. So it's not all black, black. But there's a lot of black in her hair, too. Uh, the, the streaks in her hair, the highlights. It looks more like the black is the highlight and the purple is her natural color. Because her skin's kind of purplish, I'm guessing that's her natural color. And the black is just like an outline. Because it doesn't really look like her hair is black. has black at all as part of the color. It's just like the outline of it. But there you go. That's Nova by Micah Jelena. And it was released Monday to everybody. And today it is Friday. So I'm sure a lot of you have already seen it. But for those who didn't see these new releases, um, I don't think I bought all of them. Because I think there were six or seven of them that were released this week. Um, but I figured four was enough. And... Yeah, I hope you enjoyed this, but this is just a portion of what you're going to see from Diamond Art Club in the next week. This is actually part three of my Diamond Art Club haul, which, you know, I haven't put one up for that haul in a while, um, but the whole Diamond Art Club week is the haul that I was unboxing in that haul and committing to a week of Diamond Art Club unboxings. Is going to make it where I'm going to actually get them opened and unboxed and you can see everything that I have that you I haven't shown you yet and I and trust me I don't have um, everything that they own you, as much as you're gonna think that I don't <laughs> and you know there are some of their images that just don't talk to me and I don't care to own, but it doesn't change their quality at all. It doesn't mean that their quality isn't as good on those. They're just images that don't, aren't, I mean, I'm not a big flower person, so you really won't see me buying flower diamond paintings, but there you go. I hope you guys enjoyed this part three of my Diamond Art Club haul, and if you have any questions, leave them down below. Uh, if you want, if you don't have any kind of coupon to use for Diamond Art Club, you can use my, the link that I have down below to get 10% off. And if you have something better, by all means, go for it. Um, I really don't benefit from the link that you give below. It gives me like a $10 off coupon, but... I think you once you buy something with the code, but I'm not worried about it. I have a bunch of them that I, I use one every time I order. So don't worry about it. If you don't want to use it and you have something bigger, please use that. Um, also, um, yeah, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. I really appreciate it when people, um, stop to do that just lets me know that you're watching and that you liked what you saw leave me um, um leave a comment down below let me know which one of these four would be your favorite and i look forward to seeing them and also seeing you in my next video so have fun diamond painting and don't forget to always sparkle wherever you go and whatever you do take care everyone Bye.